Well, let's take a look at how race two unfolded. It was Enzo Trulli on pole ahead of Christian Mansell, but it was Philippe Caminiars there storming through to try and take second and then go on to take the lead very briefly as they all make it through the source. It looked like Matthias Luton in the background. They're getting forced out wide and then clattering uh, the curb on his return. Enzo Trulli under a huge amount of pressure from Caminiars at the very start of this race in the battle for the lead, heading up Eau Rouge on to the Kemmel straight and here it was where the toe proved most effective. Louis Foster able to get ahead of Nazim Asman and Trulli in the early stages and then Louis Foster able to take the lead overall in front of Asman and both of them got Trulli a little earlier on. This was a battle a little further back in the pack. Josh Mason coming through the back of the pack uh, fighting with Cameron Das who managed to do a brilliant move down Mason and Chopinek to take two at the end of the Kemmel straight. And then further pain for Enzo Trulli, who was then overtaken by Casper Stevenson. The pole man not being able to hang with the leaders. Then this battle ended in tears in race one. Race two, Chovanec able to get the move done on Luton in this fierce battle for the last points paying positions. But no one could match this man once again, who's done the double here in Spa with one race still to go. Louis Foster is your race winner from race two here in Euro Formula ahead of Cameron Das and Nazim Asman.